the Oxford to London tube bus. Right now I'm inside the bus and as you can see it's behind me. You can uh, put your luggage over here. They have the washroom also here inside. And let me show you how the bus looks from inside. So guys as you can see they have a hook here. USB or free Wi-Fi also they have here. You can charge your mobile from here. And it's easy to eat something same like airplanes. And this is a bus. They have also, if you want to sit up, you can easily sit upstairs. So the house looks. See, there's a space from from the front and the back. You can keep your luggage on the top as well. It's completely warm from inside and it's looking good. So this bus is uh, has around 14 stops. So if you want to take the bus from different stations, yes, you can take. Um, if you will, you know, uh, get down in, at the Victoria station or uh, you can also take from this bus from the airport as well. If you will take, want to take the bus near to the uh, Victoria station, bus station, so you need to go, I think, Green Line uh, coach station. This is the last stop of this bus and uh, I'm going to London right now. From London to I will go to Swansea by Flexbus. I already made the video if you want to travel uh, from uh, London to uh, Swansea. You can just travel only in six pounds. Mm, if you will book by uh, National Coach Express buses, so it will be more costly. It will be around uh, 15 pounds, let's say double completely. And if you are a student, if you have got your uh, you know university email id then you will get 15 percent discount otherwise you need to pay full amount so rather than to travel any other bus i will really recommend to travel by flex bus according to me that is more convenient more ease and it was really nice bus from inside they have also washroom in every buses here means uh, all long journey buses you will find that washroom inside so you don't need to go out or to think of when it will stop because uh, when I came here to the Oxford, the journey was from Swansea to Oxford, it was seven hours long journey. Now I'm going uh, to London for my PCC. I will make the another video. What is PCC? It's Police Clearance Certificate. Uh, before coming here, I didn't bring with, with me actually, so I have to go there. And uh, I need to pay around 40 to 45 pounds for that. So if you are coming from there, uh, you know, from India or any other country, please bring your police clearance certificate with you. It will be really easy to get the job or if you want to apply somewhere, I might be applied for visa also, they will ask. Uh, so I'm going there because my uh, employer, they were asking that to, I have to submit it. So better if you are coming here, please bring this certificate with you. And this video is about this bus. So hope you will find this bus it's easy you can just download the app uh, the app is available by the name of oxford tube bus you can uh, download easily and see the journey the journey goes around this if you are a student it will cost you 12 pounds but you have to be you know with your university card otherwise it will cost you 18 pounds so i have paid 18 pounds right now and i'm going uh, from oxford to london now and from there after completing my work i have a bus around three o'clock and uh, i will go to swansea back to swansea <laughs> okay guys so i will show you the around okay it's completely dark right now because uh, it's around now 6 30 you can say almost around 6 30 yes okay see ya
have finally have reached to the Victoria station at the London and uh, so from this stop you can take the bus uh, to go back to the Oxford and especially it's really good bus for the students those who are coming from India or from any other country uh, to the London and from here they want to go to Oxford so it's a direct bus, bus from there uh, so it's take around 2.5 minutes means uh, let's say around two hours to two and a half hours okay so it depends on the traffic depend on the time so it will take around that time but it's really convenient you have the you will get the luggage space there washrooms are inside so no problem you can just use the bus really easily and conveniently you can reach uh, to the Oxford especially though if you are uh, studying in Brooks University so they have a stop front of the Brooks University as well so you can get up there or on the high street from there there are many uh, uh, universities around there so you can take another bus or the taxi from to go at your uh, home or your cause anywhere where the hotel whatever you have booked there it will be really easy so now is my time to go so currently i am going to move uh, from here i will go to the indian embassy for my bcc police certificate so let's go i will show you what is the process and how it will be okay i will make the separate video for that stay tuned